we're looking at the uh, Amazonian statues, female. So let's get these open. Ziploc bags, always good. What have we got in this one? This one is the, is this the stone one? Yep, this is a stone variant. Let's get her open. Again, the same as the uh, the male versions of these. There's a little bit of to uh, super glue together. Let's get the other one open. Again, that's uh, the non-stone variant. Right, let's get these stuck together. Start with the uh, non-stone variant. Now, comparing this to, to the male equivalents, these bases are a lot nicer. They actually look like sort of Roman columns rather than just sort of stone square fence. So there's a nice little bit of detail there on the bottom. All good. Now the figs themselves, as you can see straight away, her spear is, is really bent. I, th I thought it was a bow initially when I was putting on it, it was so bent, but it is a spear. But, you know, a nice little bit of detail with the feathers. Let's see if we can zoom in on that. There we go. Now, I think what I've done is I've stuck the wrong helmet on the wrong model. That'll teach me she's got the cracked model and she's not the cracked model. So I'll see if I can pull that off later. Yeah, the shields are different as well. On the male variant there were uh, Medusa heads. And on these they are uh, like a Minotaur or a Bull. It's a Bull. But again, nice shields, nice models. The same with the, uh, with the guys, you can, you know, they're detachable. You can use the plinth separately, you can use them with the plinth. You can have them step down and attack. Let's look at this stone variant that I've accidentally stuck the non-stone uh, helmet on. Again, she's very similar, but just comes with that sort of stone cracking. And that goes through the shield, through her body, and on her weapon as well. But again, the weapon on this is badly bent too. It's almost like a, almost like a bow. But there she is. And again, the same with the male variant. You can have these as like two guards. You could trigger some sort of mechanism. You can have them step down and attack. You could have them just by themselves. Or you could use these plinths for uh, for anything really, for putting other minis on. I'm sure there's, let's grab something and uh, you know, you can stick any old thing on here you want. But yeah, great figures, really useful. I can see these being used in games. Um, just a shame I stuck the wrong helmets on the wrong figures. Yeah, but these are brilliant. Uh, they were the Amazonian statues. Um, if you like the video, hit like. If you want to see more, check out my videos. If you want to see the upcoming videos uh, as they're released, hit the bell, hit, uh, hit like, hit subscribe, and you'll see them all coming up. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.